All right, PS2 emulation can still be a bit dodgy, so there's no guarantee this is gonna work all too well. Oh my God, that looks grim. Well, that's all part of the experience. Let us press the start button. So this is the X-Files resistor serve for the PlayStation 2. I have never played this game before outside of a few minutes to make sure everything works okay. I still don't guarantee that it does. I had to do a manual fix to stop cutscenes from flickering. Otherwise though, well, let's just play the game and see what it has to offer. Uh, Fox or Dana? Let's just eyeball it in chat. Who are we going to play as? I don't think there were any specifications this punishment. So we'll just go with it as it comes. But who will we be? I never watched the X-Files. Don't really know anything about it. So I know nothing of these characters. Dana, 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 Scully. Alright, people leave. seem to love the Scully here. Seems like I'm forced into episode one, so let's do it. Uh, sure, act one. Сюда, сюда! Давай идем, уже недалеко. Мой ангел, твой безумный папа говорит, что мы почти пришли. Посмотри, оно еще здесь. Вот оно. Это Прекрасно. Это чудо. Знак Божий. Это становится большим. Мы должны отсюда уйти. Что? Почему? Сейчас! Sixteen-year-old sisters Mandy and Caitlin Winslow. The pair disappeared from their stepfather's Red Falls trailer home two weeks ago, only to reappear recently, coinciding with the mysterious deaths of three Red Falls residents. Coinciding. I'm guessing I wouldn't be looking at their profiles unless someone thought these girls were directly involved. Actually, most of the angry citizens of Red Falls hold the twins responsible. It seems Mandy and Caitlin Winslow are practitioners in the ancient art of witchcraft. Witchcraft? The pilgrims want justice. The officer who contacted me, Sheriff Bud Smith, is concerned about the twins' safety. Are you telling me we're driving into a witch hunt, Mulder? If you want to catch witches, you have to go on a witch hunt, Scully. And I assume there's a reason other than one of the girls wears a pentagram to make you believe they both practice witchcraft. Those fingers in my hair, that sly come hither stare. Do I have to recite the rest of the lyrics? I got the joke, Mulder. Come on, Scully, you know the words. Sing with me. Mulder, these victims were strangled, brutalized in horrific ways with someone's bare hands. An assailant profile would have to start with a very large, extremely powerful male. And you'd be right. All the evidence, including fingerprints, points to one man, Frank Hawthorne. So why isn't Frank Hawthorne the primary suspect? Because Frank Hawthorne died in a drunk driving accident. 24 hours prior to the deaths of the three murder victims. And the people of Red Falls believe that Mandy and Caitlin Winslow are using black magic to... what? Raise the dead and create killer zombies? Kids today, huh? 
Mulder, you're not buying into that mob mentality. You can't tell me teenage girls with a high school interest in the occult have somehow managed to raise the dead. Hey, I've seen them do it on Buffy. Mulder, stop! Oh, God. Sir, hang on. I'm a medical doctor. I want you to let me open your jacket, okay? Mulder! I'm on it, Scully. Mulder, he's shot. Deputy, who did this to you? What's happening here? This is a bad dream, right? Mulder! I can't get a signal. I'm gonna find a hard line. Are you okay here, Scully? Yes, hurry. Come on, Deputy. Stay with me. No. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, we're off to a good start. Uh, I don't know the controls, so that could be a little awkward. All right, I think I'm onto something. There we go. Uh, excuse me, sir. Right, uh, got out of that pickle, but I still don't really know what I'm doing here. So, left analog to move, right analog to do this. <laughs> uh, R1 to aim, and then X to fire. Reload. Okay, uh, square to do a little dance. Resume options, abort, restart options. Is there one for controls? Hey, that's what we're talking about. Uh, reloads. There we go, right. Maybe the people that ran the Mario Marathon could learn a thing or two about swiftly picking up a game's controls and the overall gist of it. Because holy moly, the incompetence that we've been seeing has been staggering. Okay, maybe we should go and speak to our partner. Was there a button for run? There we go. Oh, he's locked inside there. That is spooky stuff. Put our gun away, there's no need for violence here. Okay, <laughs> we can start punching things as well. Excellent. Tell you what, I liked having a light out. Where's my light? There we go. Just climb on top of the rubbish bin. You can be mad at a Mario, uh, bad at a Mario against a soup dog. You have no clue how Mr. bad it gets. Right? I'm fine, Mulder. I heard gunshots. The service of JJ leaves a lot to be desired. I'm guessing you had the same problem I did. The deputy had some kind of psychotic episode. I was treating him, and he died. Scully? I thought I lost his pulse, but he certainly wasn't dead while he was attacking me. Look, the front door to the diner here is blocked, but I want to take a look around back. Mulder, we need to find the Sheriff Bud Smith. Maybe he knows what the hell's going on. I think we know, Scully. We need to find Caitlin and Mandy Winslow before this place turns into the thriller video. I'll meet you at the Sheriff's Station. I'll keep trying for an outside signal, but at least the two-way radio still works. If I were a fan of the show, which I am not, I'd imagine that this is actually going to be a really cool experience. Uh, right, do we have one for subtitles? I would really... no. Wow. Tell you, these settings leave a lot to be desired. Video, just aspect ratio, audio, stereo... Dang. Well, let's crank up the volume because it was pretty low. And I'm going to remind myself on the uh, controls there because I've already forgotten quite a few of them. Uh, toggle... Malayan light. Oh, there's a Molotov. Interesting. All right. We'll try punching to death the next thing we find. So immediately, I'm feeling uh, Resident Evil here, down to the music, as it happens. Are we gonna have cool door transitions as well? No. Anything going on in here? That's a whole lot of no as well. Okay, well, given all the broken doors, maybe it is more Silent Hill. Now, 
let's keep the gun available. Never know when things are going to go Pete Tong here. <laughs> Door opening animations! Okay, I don't want to jump the gun on this uh, eight minutes in, but this game looks really good. It's got that... Uh, it's got that tanky Resident Evil Dino Crisis stuff that I actually really like. This map stuff takes me to Silent Hill too. And unlike Resident Evil, I don't know this game inside out, so any spooks are gonna come out of nowhere for me. Ooh, what's going on in the phone? Room 6. Time for room service. How do I know if I'm injured or anything? Was there a status? Here we go. Ew. Pistol, flashlight, limited inventory slots, just like Resident Evil. Uh, can I examine the things? Just to clear this the new long play, Jake. I'm not so sure it'd be long enough for a long play. Maybe, uh, maybe enough for a weekly one shot, though. Right, where is number six? Do we have to go upstairs for that? Back in five minutes, light. Oh, that's right. D-pad's not for movement. D-pad up brings me map. Up, down brings me uh, the notes here. Searching for help, something unexplained. Deputy appears to have died. Moments later, I was attacked. Gate is locked. Can't seem to override it right now. Let's put the gun away so that I can actually run around here a bit more. I don't suppose anybody can check the credits list for this game and see if any of the people who attributed to this worked on Resident Evil or Silent Hill because I am feeling it. Well, if the door is locked on 6 and it said that there's something going on on 6, then what am I to get out of that? Unless there was an interaction I could do here, but... No, it just says the light is on. Oh, right there we go. Getting the key would help. These graphics are something else. Which is to say, pretty bad. And there was somebody in chat saying that they were really into... Dana Mueller here. Her name is Dana Mueller, right? I can check that. Uh, I guess so. That writing is tiny. There are options to increase the resolution in game the PS2. I'm not sure if I've cranked it up or not. Maybe this is it cranked up. It was a notoriously low definition console, but that's okay. Ooh. I'm a federal agent. I want you to step away from the bed and show me your hand. He <laughs> shows the hands all right. Oh, okay. Damn, she's quick on the reload. What's your story, stranger? loot what we can here. It feels really stiff. Just like Resident Evil. What did I, what did I pick up there, though? Alright, so it's square to take it out. No, it's triangle to take it out and put it away. Square is that. That's the, okay. It's actually a brawler game. 
I think it was a gate key, right? Oh boy, these tank controls are uh, not so hot. They're not even tank controls. It's free controls, but the shifting uh, camera makes it snap quite a lot. A big stru- oh! Come on, who needs some of this? Huh, the music betrays the situation. Oh! Christ, right, get beating. Your days are numbered! <laughs> Is he gonna die or what? Yes! Agent Muley does it again. All right, have at. Oh no, the homeless. gone insane and it needs to be cleaned up. Who put this one forward? I suspect that someone just wanted Jake to experience some punishment. Well, it was Tandy and Dr. Spengler. I would not expect Tandy to put something uh, put forward something enjoyable. Spengler? Well, the jury's out on him, but the reason we're running this one isn't because I failed a weekly one-shot. It's because when we did the marble thingamajigger uh, for Christmas, I said that whoever won the marble race could uh, force me to stream whatever they want. And Spengler chose this after winning, and what a win it was. See the lighting on this? It's actually very good. It's not very good, but you have to consider when this came out, which is, at a glance, early PS2 era. code. The office is a crime scene. The whole village is a crime scene here, Dana. I'll be here all day if I try and brute force, what was it, a six digit combination? Oh! Deary me. How about we close the door behind us? No? Okay. Well, let's hope we don't get jumped while we're here. If I were into X-Files and I'd been given this as a present, I would be uh, very happy. Oh Her arms were amputated while she was still alive. Not sure if amputated is the word you can really use in this situation. The bigger shock is that she was at work and just wearing socks. <laughs> Wait, that's just my aspirin. Alright, we gotta take a note about that. Doctor's receptionist dead in a brutal display of skillful amputation. Only someone with medical knowledge would be so capable. Dr. Henry Dawson is unaccounted for. 
<laughs> Don't get too excited there, young. It's just a game. Get yourself weighed up. No? Okay. I have a strong suspicion that I missed something in that room. Let's put the gun away and go, go running for a bit. She runs like she's in molasses. Hold on, is that a door? Hang on, there's already police line do not cross, so where's the where's the actual police around here? Okay, forgive me for hoping for some kind of clue around here. Oh, oh ho. Yeah, sure, let's save. Jake, I think you run him down and shot him earlier. Really? There's only one policeman in this whole place? Right, well, can't get through there, don't have a number, can't get through there, it's all locked up tight. Lots of doors that just won't open. How's the map situation here? <clears throat> Ooh, not too shabby. And it's being drawn on just like in Silent Hill. I mean, so far this game doesn't have an original bone to its body, but it's doing things not too shabbily. Well, I suppose this is pretty original. <laughs> oh, jings malings. Alright, better be ready for anything. The homeless could be back. Flocking to the location to pick apart all the aspirin. Actually, any of these guys have any aspirin on them? That's a no. Is it raining? It is raining. Jings, she must be getting soaked to the bone here. Hmm? Oh, that was a transition. I thought I was stealing one of the bikes. Whoa, now! Cease and desist! made of ammo here, so let's, uh, let's use our uh, close combat techniques here. Something shiny on the ground. What do we have? Some bolt cutters and, whoa, oh, Krivens! Oh dear! Perhaps I can run away. No, it won't open. Freeze. them anymore. Whilst the slow and clunky movement can seem quite arduous, it's actually a pretty good way to build up horror in a game like this. Make you feel quite helpless in dealing with the uh, the threats at large. Alright, is it just the one? Alright, come on then. I'll channel my inner Manette here. You're gonna need an intern yourself. A medical one. Kidney kick, kidney kick, kidney kick. Alright, come on, I'll give you a fighting chance. <laughs> ah, ah, ah. 
I'm living out my American dream here. <laughs> Steal his ammo while we're at it. Okay, how is the ammo situation? Nay, great. This is probably a double bill of failure punishment games. Well, no, a good punishment game is at least one of three things. It's either punishing for me to play, punishing for you collectively to watch, or extremely difficult. Now, I didn't find Heroes of Might and Magic 7 all that punishing to play because I didn't have the nostalgia factor caning me at every blow there. And it wasn't particularly difficult, but from what I could tell, it was at least punishing for people to watch. So it was a it was a winner on that front. This game, though, doesn't seem that hard. It's enjoyable for me to play. The jury's out on you guys watching, but uh, I would clock this up as quite a failure here. What was Spengler thinking? Oh, I've just done a full loop here. Right, I probably missed somewhere to enter in the other place then. You know, Scully keeps knives in the toe of her pumps. Is that true now? You didn't say that Marble Victors had to pick a punishment game. No, I didn't, and they didn't have to. However, Spengler specifically picked his own punishment game. I don't actually know why Tandy backed uh, this one as well, though. All right, Map, you gonna offer me any insight here? I don't know which direction I am in this whole thing. Can't seem to steal the car, even though it's obviously on. What a crummy looking town. Nowhere's letting me in, sadly. Oh, you've asked for it now. Stay down. <laughs> Beat him like the drums. No, he's not carrying anything. Um, what 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 was that um, movie where the guy, I think his name's Ash, chops off his hand and puts a chainsaw on it? Evil Dead. Uh, Evil Dead, the PS1 game, had a lot of uh, picking up items off of dead uh, corpses. Which really reduced the horror a lot. Because it became more of a glory kill game. But before I realized Sheriff? that, it was pretty good. Sheriff Smith? Oh, come on, the dead are roaming the streets. You think the sheriff's is just uh, sitting back here? Let's steal his keys at least. Hmm? I thought there were keys there to steal. Ill-placed PC. Cabinets all locked. <laughs> there's, a, there's a target for practice on the wall there. Do Americans really? His notes? No, that's still the map. I discovered Dr. Receptionist Dead. No, we've, we've been through that one already. Then. I'm guessing this is a consumable rather than some kind of clue. Ah, here's the sheriff's note. Contact S.A. Fox Mulder. Isolate girls.
Perhaps I could make use of these bolt cutters in some fashion, but I don't recall finding anything that needed that except for those bicycles. Kid you not, I am really impressed by what I'm seeing in this game so far. I mean, it's not impressive by 2021 standards, but by 2000 and standards, it's good. Okay. Crazy son of bitches. I'm the only one with half a brain. I don't care, stupid mother. Sir, who are you? I'm goddamn Superman. Come get me, witch. I'm an FBI agent. I need you to tell me anything you can about what's going on here. Witches. Two evil witches. They're turning the town into something not good. Sheriff is letting them do it, too. Do you know where Sheriff Smith is? Oh, he's crazy. <coughs> Locks me up for booze. Let witches run loose. He, he had one of them here. Tried to protect her. <coughs> they got her, though. Sir, how long have you been in here without your medicine? Too long. I haven't had a woman, either. You will die without your medicine. Do you have more? Top of the TV at home. <laughs> Trailer park south of here. You one of them witches? You're making it very hard for me to want to save you. I'm going to get your medicine, okay? Get into bed. <laughs> Come on, we need a bit of sparring going on. Oh, he can't be killed. Well, can't blame me for trying. Wait, you can, but you can't blame me for not trying. My keys are on the desk! I knew there were keys there. There we go. I wonder if limited, um, limited inventory space is going to be a problem. Oh, come on, Agent, this is the boys' bathroom. If this was Deus Ex, you'd be getting chewed out for it. What was that first aid stuff? <laughs> Probably inspired by Nancy Drew to be a kleptomaniac. At least the lights are on in this place. Right, he said trailer park south of here, right? That's what I choose to remember. Mm -hmm. Very hard to keep my bearings because I don't know north from uh, north from anything when I'm outside. In 2004, you had Oblivion or this? Yeah, well, this is on the PlayStation. Oblivion is on the Master Race PC. Not the fairest comparison in the world. Mikey's pointing out that Oblivion came out in 2006. 2004, I would have had Resident Evil Outbreak at that time. Ah man, what a game. If you could only fathom how good of a game that is. And you can, because I've streamed it multiple times, because it's very good. But soon, won't even need to worry about that, because 2021 is the year of Outbreak HD's release. Oh man, the world's never going to be the same again. These corpses here. Not very hygienic. Am I really going the right way here? I mean, I'm going the blocked way, but maybe now I can somehow open this up. No, it's all cordoned off. Do those things really flash? What powers them? I? 
Oh, I'm way back at the start here, which I'm not convinced is where I need to be. However, having a source of light would be a good idea. Let's uh, have a look at that trailer key we picked up. Yeah, I'm not having an easy time navigating in this game, that's for sure. But naturally I'm no good at navigation, so I wouldn't hold that against the game. Uh, put me on the edge with all these spookies. Oh, oh. That's that X symbol. I thought that was something we used to save. Someone has taped an. Okay, yeah, by looking at the X and thinking about it, we gain the power to save. Shout out to JJ, who uh, didn't realize that autosaves weren't a thing back in the 1980s, and uh, did not save his Mario progress, so back to World 5 in Super Mario Bros. 1 he goes. Kids these days. First semi-coherent witness, E. Chaco, indicated that Sheriff Smith was here with one of those two evil witches, presumably Caitlin or Mandy. They got her, though, were his words. Mulder's concerned. People are... Da -da 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 -da. He has knowledge of what's happening. Further interrogation has to wait. His cardiac... something or other requires steady dotus of something else. They've not been administered. I'll need to retrieve medication from his trailer home. Cannot lose the sole witness to the events. Hmm. Odds of his survival? I don't think they're too high. Where in God's name is the, uh... The trailer park, though? What are even my options for progressing here? <laughs> Buckled under the weight of Jake's expectations. Ha ha ha! Hold on, could I bolt cutter these uh, these things away? Secured with a giant heavy bolt. Well, I think I have the solution for this problem. Okay, well that tells me that you don't contextually get to use items. You have to go into the menu to use them. Alright, trailer park, here we go. There was actually a trailer park in my nearest town where I grew up. An inexhaustible source of gypsy scum. Alright. Time to take out years of frustration. You know, for the undead, they are fairly vulnerable to kicks to the kidneys. Alright, sadly I can't steal his bat. He did bash me a bit. Man, my... <laughs> now I'm certain that's your damage indicator. But what I'm getting out of that is that just my calves really hurt from kicking all these homeless people. Okay, so that is a 3D object, but holy moly, it sure looked 2D from this angle. Touché game. What a grim looking place. Alright, can we get inside? Oh, in, 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 in. Now I 
I see. The only survivor because he's built an immunity to every gem imaginable. Ah, okay, they can't touch me here. A cigarette lighter? Is that really what I'm here for? Oh! Did they do this in the TV show? Somebody give me the lowdown of the X Files TV show then. Preferably if you are an avid fan of it. Probably where I could imagine it's gone. I could imagine the whole like paranormal stuff has really died away. Now that everybody carries high quality uh, video recorders and cameras on them at all times. Things like UFOs and the Loch Ness Monster, stuff like that. I don't know, Elvis and Bigfoot. They, they've just died a death, right? You can't, uh, you can't reasonably make anybody... Oh! Inventory scrolls. That feels like cheating. But I have his medication. X-Files is about Skeptic Scully, your character, and Believer Mulder tracking down supernatural stuff with a heavy focus on aliens. Take every six hours for cardiac arrhythmia. I don't even know what that is. Nor will I ever. Because even if you told me now, I <laughs> obtained a beer bottle? What, are we going to give that to him as well? Or is there something inside? There is not something inside. Betty's never again ergot ale. Amazing. Boy, I, I am envious of anybody that got given this game in the early 2000s. Well, mid 2000s. Oh, no, 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 not dogs. I do not like. Gah, Christ! Mold here. Oh, she is about to die. Well, that was savage. Might need his, uh. Might need his medicine for myself at this rate. Yeah, Jake does not like hurting dogs in games. Alright. Oh well. Hmm. It would have come out of something shiny there. Hopefully, some aspirin. No, it's just another bottle. Could I drink the booze? Will that heal me up? That's a no. I can't believe this game evaded me. Granted, I would have seen the X-Files and just been like, mm, yeah, no. Now, somebody had marked this to me as, you know, it's like Resident Evil, but uh, not be in a different story. Ah, uh, different times. I will never hold a grudge against the Confederate flag. There was a particularly cold winter, and I had no bedding except for one confederate flag, which I slept under. It was very cold, but it was slightly less cold than I would have been without it. Why my born and raised Scottish parents had a confederate flag on hand, 
I will never know. Because I won't ask. Uh, where am I even going? I need to go back to the sheriff's office. Flags are not known for being warm so slightly. Well, they're known for being burnt, and that makes them warm for a short period of time. I'd be lying if I said I remember where the uh, sheriff's office is, so we'll just keep going until we find it. And you stand, I'll try you? Probably. Are you the sheriff's office? I suppose I could consult my map for five seconds. Just around the bend. Did you also sing Take Me Home Country? Well, I, I don't know these, uh, these songs. I'm not an American. Some people tell me that I sound American. I don't know what to make of that. Then again, who was it who said on the Caesar 3 thing? It's like, why is the homeless guy Scouse and the trader American? That Jesus. cracked me up. No, no, ah! Uh huh. Better be ready for anything. Unhand my only witness. First, they're rising from the dead, and then they're taking cheap shots from behind. That's just bullshit. Mulder, are you all right? What happened? I found the deputy here trying to squeeze this man through the cell bars. Chaco, I was here earlier. I ran to get his heart medicine. Did you get a good look at the deputy, Scully? I shot this man. That's impossible. It's the hot new trend in town. Once one dead guy comes back, they all have to do it. I can't subscribe to the theory that these people were all dead, Mulder. They're suffering some acute delirium, resistant to normal thresholds of pain, like, like someone on PCP. Angel Dust users normally can't take a dozen shots to the chest, Scully. So, what then? Are you still suggesting that the two missing girls are witches and they're causing this? I found one of the girls, Mandy, dead, hanging in the center of town. And I think our Sheriff Bud Smith is playing for the other team. It was his shotgun. I don't feel so good, but that thing bit me. He's going into anaphylactic shock. Scully, can you test the deputy for an infectious agent? If I had the equipment, Mulder. I was in the doctor's office before, but there's a crime scene lock on the door. Well, the sheriff should have a record of the combination here somewhere. They talk so fast. Oh, oh, thank God. First aid kit. Chomp that right down. Great, now it's just my thighs that are burning. Oh, are you coming with me? Oh, please tell me we travel it. Yes! Oh, it was my favorite short-lived part of Resident Evil 2 was where you actually traveled with Ada Wong and she would fight with you. Sadly, it was just through two very short and inconsequential areas. Sewer and over to the marshalling uh, yard. Alright, great. Well, do you have a health bar on this screen? Not that I can see. That means you are going to fight and die for me. Incidentally, I tried to kill Ada, but uh, it just couldn't be done. Maybe she could die, but she would always dish out enough damage to uh, to defend herself. That was a noise and a half, wasn't it? Where am I even going? Probably going to go over to the um, the hospice and get ourselves some equipment. with the key we just picked up. File cabinet key. Wait, there were cabinets in there. Is it even a punishment game if it's from a marbles win? Absolutely. It was on the punishment list after all. But so far, it's quite the punishment. Well, all right, got we got a file folder. Tell me more. Oh, it probably has a combination on it. Am I meant to be able to read this? Oh, oh, oh I thought I could open it up there. Well, I'm gonna guess that's what I need. I've already forgotten the number, so let's look at it again. 57383. Three. Uh, maybe. 
amazing. <laughs> this, is, this is just daft. Is he just a giant? He's walking at the pace that we're running. He's just a lot further away than he seems. Uh, wait, where was even the clinic? Dancing, right? Dang, maybe if I'd left all the freaks alive in the uh, the streets, my colleague here could have put them to dust. Five, seven, three, eight. Hmm? Interesting. Mulder's a wimp, he couldn't have killed nothing. For real? I mean, he, he looks fairly durable. He's not very tall, though. He looks a bit of a manlet. But, you know, manlets, uh, they have tenacity to make up for the fact they can't reach the top row in the baker. He's getting a nice bite. Oh, go on, defend yourself, man. Oh, man, do I have to do everything? I think we've had quite enough of experts here. Down you go. My legs are getting tired. You do some work. Wow, he just doesn't want to do anything. Mulder, you're hurt. I had to think that guy's a doctor. <laughs> bit you. I don't think I'm doing so good, Scully. Mulder, you're infected. I have to find out if the doctor passed some kind of toxin into your system. I'll make sure you have room to work. Uh, okay. I guess I'll put on some gloves and start carving him up. Okay. Uh... Look, it's been a long time since I've played Trauma Center. Oh, is that what I want to do? Alright, let's just hack away at him. Alright, maybe he needs an injection first. No? Okay, maybe hacking was the right idea. Now, 
Yeah, that's enough off top sink. Are we still under attack? We are. Oh boy. Ah, well, I'll just get on with it. Maybe I should have watched the show if this is the kind of stuff they get up to. I am holding it. It's not doing a lot. Yeah, Bully definitely did this one better. Oh! Hey! Alright, let's open you up, sunshine. Good God! Pepperoni pizza, what a pleb. Not the biggest fan of pepperoni, must be said. I mean, I'll eat it, but I'll eat anything. Alright, where else are you wanting sliced up in, Chief? Maybe I need no tool, and just to rip... No, I can't unselect a tool. Hmm... I didn't save in a while, so I'm a little worried having to do all this again. Oh wait, no, that, no that's just up, down, left, right. Uh, well, what else you wanted me to do here, Muley? Did we get what we needed? Oh, right, no, I have uh, a stomach sample from him is essential in order to identify the toxin and create an antidote. Are we sure about that? Also, I can't see a dang thing in here. Alright, there we go. Maybe I can create something over here. That's a good start. Let's get ourselves actually healed up. Now only my feet hurt from kicking all this ass. What do you make of this one then, uh, young? It's bile and pepperoni pizza in a syringe. What's the market value of that? Uh, what else did I pick up there, by the way? There was something else, right? Microscope slides. Is it like a combine thing? There is a combine. Oh! -ho! This stomach acid smear reveals all. I just don't know what. How about one stolen kid's bike? It's the best I can give you. Oh, that's uh, waste not want not on the ammo clip. How's things going out there? Down he went. Uh, I wonder if I could use restart instead and not go back to the last place where I saved because that was a wee while back. Oh no, no, Christ. It takes me all the way back to the start of the, the bit here. Right, well, got a bit of retracing our steps to do. 
probably involves the dogs. Man, what a wimp. Save and forgot to save often. Yeah, forgive me for not expecting that bit there. Alright, but we know what to do, so this shouldn't take too long. Go back, clip open the gate, grab the bits and bobs. Oh, hang on, have I already been to the... Yeah, need to go to Chaco's trailer here. Uh, the question is, where was that area where I had to trim open the gates? Because I can't even remember. I feel like it was up here, though. Yeah, I think this is it. Alright, heavy bolt. Should ask Eurysta what he thinks about heavy bolters. Alright, come on. Have at. Oh! He's got a wide swing on that thing. She must really have knives in those pumps if she's uh, bringing blood out from all that. Oh god, no more pikeys! Your job seeker allowance just got cancelled. Alright, done and done right, and the damage we took was minimal and to our feet as usual. Oh man. open. I think the only thing I was able to do was check out the uh, the beer full place. Now nah, let's have our gun drawn and ready for this. Because those doglets are having none of us. Now I see. The only survivor because he's built an immunity to every germ imaginable. Got his medication, got his beer. Got the lighter, though I don't know why we'd pick that up. And there was another beer bottle out here as well. You really get caught in the geometry a lot in this one, sadly. Oh, cribbins, that's, that's painful stuff. They get a lot of hits in, they do. I don't think there was anything over here, but I want to check. Just a dead dog. Ooh, our, fo our footsteps are all bloody. Is that because we ran through dead dog, or is it because our feet are bleeding? What the heck? I ran around in a circle there. For all the people that knock tank controls, with tank controls, you hold up and you will go in a straight line through hell or high water. In this one, the game snaps and readjusts your uh, your direction for you, which is less than helpful. Slightly old meme lacking spatial awareness says, weren't there two dogs last time? Yes, and there were two dogs this time. Oh yeah, tank controls are for sure consistent. Uh, where was that save point? I can't remember. 
There was one inside the, um... There was one inside here, as I recall. Yeah, so I can get that afterwards. Yeah, there was one at the motel, but I'm certain there was one in the, um, in the doctors. Sure, there's a lot of running through Discount Silent Hill here. I guess Dana here just really wants to conserve energy. With glorified power walking. I mean, I'm dying to know what's going on in this case, so I'm, I'm sticking through this run for a while. Jesus! Yeah, yeah, we saw it all. No, no, ah! I'll save you. First, they're rising from the dead. I mean, it was a great scene and all, but we've seen it before. Hang on, he didn't have a med kit on him. What is this? Don't tell me the game has intelligent uh, availability of items. It probably gave me a med kit last time because it got trashed by the dogs. Not this time. making a spooky noise. Mulder, I got it. All those noises. All those spooky noises. I wouldn't feel so safe in this uh, sheriff's office. Little low on ammunition. Is the number still the same? Yeah. Five seven thirty-eight three. You missed the ammo clip in the trailer. Okay. Well, not to worry, since Mueller here can surely take care of all the enemies for us again. It feels like we're being chased by the least threatening four foot five man imaginable. And that bar is pretty low. on the wall. It's not this one, that's uh, police do not cross line. Was it in the restroom? Nothing's going on in that restroom. Come on, X marks the spot. Here we go. Great, never have to do that part again. So I'll never be able to go and get that uh, ammo pack again. Alright, guns out. Does he have his gun out or is he just wandering around? No, he did. Does he put it away? When oh, maybe that's why he was sitting around not actually doing anything. Ah, right, what was it again? 58, no, it's 57. 57, 3883, bang. But I can still melee like this, right? Yes, yes I can. Okay, that's good. We never checked out what's back here first, though. Might be... Oh, right! This looks like a good place to examine... Uh, stuff. When I make it. 
Yes, examining the place before running in and beating up doctors would have been a good idea. Still seems awfully suspicious, but we'll have to leave it at that. We need to get him infected and then uninfected by the power of pepperoni pizza. Oh no, if only I were one and a half foot taller. So if I have my gun drawn, he'll actually shoot and help out here. Well, you're hurt. I had to think that guy's a doctor. He bit you. I don't think I'm doing so good, Scully. Mulder, you're infected. I have to find out if the doctor passed some kind of toxin into your system. I'll make sure you have room to work. Hilarious. Okay, let's get to it then. Let's put on our gloves, the other thing, and let's slice this fellow open. The esophagus is benign in appearance. The stomach shows the last meal close to the time of death. <sighs> okay, keep him busy, sunshine. Whoa, oh, that one's up. Oh, Christ, there were more inside the cupboard. Sir, do you mind? I'm trying to steal the stuff. all healed up so that only our feet hurt and let's uh, combine that with that so we have a, sa a smear sample and then we investigate the sample oh god get out of my way yeah I'm about to be the one that gets bitten now right this is no good there we go keep up the good work Mueller I'll have this stuff examined in no time. Uh, what do you mean that's not enough? What am I going to do with it? Stuck here, sunshine. I, I don't get it. Oh, what else am I gonna do? Oh, well, there, there we go. There's like an unknown protein here. I need 0.2 milliliters of 1 to 1,000 epinephrine. I need 0.3 milliliters of 1 to 200 epinephrine. I need 0.4 milliliters of 1 to 100 again. I didn't listen to her there. Maybe I should do it again. I need 0.2 milliliters of 1 to 1,000 epinephrine. I need 0.3 milliliters of 1 to 200 epinephrine. I 
I need 0.4 milliliters of 1 to 100 FNF. That'll do it then. Hey, there we go. Alright, got your cure sunshine. Antidote. So what, do I just run up to him and inject him? Or do I have to beat these guys up first? How do you feel? Better. Oh, but the way I did feel, I don't think our friend in the prison cell could have survived. I made three extra doses to counteract an infection just in case. I think that this rules out witchcraft, Mulder. Just because there's a medical cure doesn't rule out a paranormal cause. I should have stuck the syringe in your ass. <coughs> did I thank you for saving my life? What about the other sister, <coughs> Caitlin? I don't know how to explain it, but somehow I know she's still alive. I've seen a vision of her. Cold and afraid. I, I don't know what it was. Well, the trailer park is south of here. Maybe there's an answer in her home. This game's bad, right? But it's good. You know what I mean. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Right, let's just walk away and have our partner help us out. If he could kindly shoot. Come on, man. I'm not wasting my ammo here. <laughs> what an execution. Don't worry, we have the antidote. But we're not going to give it to these guys. Alright, let's mop up. Is there anything I didn't get here? Old blooded killer Mueller here. Is there anybody at all in the chat who's played this game themselves? Could have warned me how good it is. <laughs> Sadly, no, I missed this gem, says Pandy. I better save up after that escapade. Ah, oh, we're doing fine though. I don't know if Muley has his own health bar. I think he just timed out in the last one from the infection, but I can't be sure. I have to know if he's saying Mueller on purpose or not. Uh, no. What's his actual name? What are either of their names? We are uh, Dana Scully. It's Mulder with a D. Mm, but Mueller sounds better. I only played it before I learned the English language, says Wooter. I never got past the motel. That sounds rough. Learning the English language, that is. Um, okay, what are we even doing now? Mulder's vital signs are steady. I created extra doses. Evidence of toxins seems to completely rule out paranormal. Mulder is unconvinced. I'm assuming that's a regular uh, theme throughout the series. There's an explanation and Mulder just says, yeah, no. Aberration, live, search for her, trailer home, oh man. Good thing we took out the dogs then. When are we going to put Mulder on a bus? Also, which was the way to the uh, trailer park? It was over here, wasn't it? I wonder if we played as Mulder, would uh, Dana have been the one that got bit? Mulder always wants to believe. Scully was a skeptic. Okay, yeah. That... Just sticking opposites together. It's like when they have the criminal team up with the hardcore cop. Right. 
right. There was ammo in here before, and there's ammo in here again. Pretty tight on the ammo, isn't it? And this is with me beating up everything that I can. Oh, no kidding, I have three on me. To think, it's just pizza. Pizza and stomach bile, and that's the antidote. Alright, uh, which trailer park home? Okay, this one then. These caravans just look so insecure. Forget going through the windows or door, you could push through the walls of these things. I was unfortunate enough to have a bunch of uh, caravan holidays as a kid. Some aspects of it weren't too bad, many aspects of it were terrible. anything in particular here keys the tag on here says Hector's garage Hector's the stepfather yes I passed the Hector's garage on the east side but didn't look in Mandy's diary the last entry was two weeks Pull ago but she mentions a hideaway called the wheelhouse we'll save time if we split up I'll check the garage all right go figure we can't have our uh, our partner with us Tanking the hits and firing the bullets so that we don't have to. I am all but certain there's something else in here. There we go. Aspirin. Ugh. Right. He said he passed by a Hector's garage, but where? See it now. Well, let's just get moving. I must have not noticed there being a tiger poster. Or do you mean Tigger? I wouldn't know. Hopefully not a dog. No, just a leapy guy. Where, where did I... Where am I going? Can't get past that way. I've already been to trailer park and whatnot. I don't know, guess we're just running around for a while. Do 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 Is this Hector's garage? No, that's the vinyl right. Pandas. Some sort of cow related place. Where in God's name am I going? I'm sure this map adds up, but in my head it does not. <laughs> what does this game have to do with resisting and serving, says Pizza? All I see is zombies. I too wonder that, but I also wonder how your resisting and serving is going on. That Mario seemed to really pack a punch. Not even at World 8 yet. Oh, Crivens. Oh, what about this? 
it won't open and there's no way we can get around it so we'll just have to plod on a cigar company hmm Dead man, no aspirin. Is this the garage? Just think, Jake. All indications are that other runners will do war. And that's the sad thing. As I said before, the best outcome is that Pizza really picks up the pace and finishes the game half decently. Young is worse than that, and nobody else manages to finish. That's not a good outcome, but it's the best one I can hope for. That said, Pizza, you sounded really close to phoning it all in. Hello, friend. Ouch! And that's, that's just the sadder part there. Genuinely trying. Okay, where in God's name am I going here? The motel was around here somewhere, but uh, I forget how I ever got there. Oh, through this, of course. If I venture through here, that's a no. Okay, this rate I'm going to be consulting the notes. I will search Hector's garage on the east side where stepdad works. Okay. Oh. This forms some kind of ace. And how do I get over there? It looks like all the ways are barred. I haven't seen any other way to get over to the east. You have you have tried to do me in for the last time. That's a postal worker, isn't it? I'm afraid FBI trumps that. Oh man. Kicking him with the bladed pumps right under the ribs. let the poor chap get up. And we're nicking his... Oh, post office back door key. Never would have assumed that, but there you go. Mm-hmm. Come now, we're not the police, TBW. We're the FBI. Since you're in the post office, can you find my missing package? I think it's gone forever. The master P.O. box key. Oh, man. If there's one place I'd love to loot, it would be a post office. Just think of all the, uh, essentially, loot boxes you have in there. I mean, sure, there's going to be a lot of crap. There's going to be a lot of not crap. Oh, nice aquarium. Double awe, somebody's cat. 
Somebody's cat made it into the game. See, if this were some Kickstarter or early access game, somebody would have paid thousands upon thousands of dollars to put their cat in the game. Also, PC has a blue screen of death. Either that or it's just looking at some crummy terminal. Alright, we're we gonna do this like it's payday two. Something's out there. It's you. Oh no, it's trying to hug me. Oh god, right in the Hmm. Well, you know, Hamster, it was funny for a while, and it would probably still be funny now, but I decided to retire Nikki before that joke got pounded into the ground too hard. Jinx, think of all the nothing you get here in Payday 2. Man, opening up these things in, uh, in Payday 2 was no fun. It wasn't exactly these, they were uh, bank holding things, but same kind of gist. You just have to hope that everybody brings a, um, a saw blade with them. It was a lot of fun in that game, but also a lot of not fun. Kind of glad I dropped it. Uh, let's take our aspirin for our sore feet. Wait, do we have any aspirin? We do, there we go. That dude definitely lost his Fasun trait. That he did. See, now I'm paranoid about killing everybody. Well, re-killing them. Since they could hold uh, vital items. Well, maybe just if they're postal workers. Uh, where am I, game? I'm in the town centre, but I want to keep heading east, since that's probably where the garage is. None of these things look like garages to me. The book mine. Vacation rental? No. No, nothing wants to open here. God, this is like Sweden at 5.30pm. Nothing's bleeding open. back at the post office, which I'm fairly certain is not where I need to be. What am I missing here? Ah, okay. I can just run over here then. Are the Swedish knights also filled with zombies? It would be a remarkable improvement. Alright, where am I going here? The ski lodge? Surely not. There we go. Yeah, I'm looking for Hector's garage. But instead I'm in some uh, music shoppy. You know, if Fox sanctioned this game, you'd think they'd be getting free reign to, uh, to have a lot of actual licensed material in here. But no, unless Quagmire was a real film. Assuming that's showing a film. And Flames? I don't really watch films or anything, so if any of this is real, I wouldn't know. It's 
So reckless youth X. Uh, he's got nothing. This is actually smaller than Mulder's collection. I think they had this area just for that joke. Sadly, nothing to grab in the adults only area. Wonder what Mulder would say in there. Really? All this for nothing? That can't be right. Well, no, let's not underestimate the fact that they might do that just for a setup. Or. What? Oh. Okay. Hmm. So then, oh, hmm. still won't open though. And you've been shoved all the way along. What's that? The sixth in extinction forever damned. Cow tipping the movie. The host. And is that VHS? VHS was never good. Nobody called it VHS. It was tapes. Not to be confused with cassette tapes. They're all X-Files episodes. Huh. You guys know that better than me. Alright, what am I still looking for? The garage. And that's a no-go. It's another no-go. Just how far east do I have to go here? Looks like very... This gate is electronically locked. It'd be hard to be threatened by somebody running up to you like that, no matter how bright that torch is. Hold on, Americans don't mean petrol stations when they say garages, right? No, Holly's Gas is not the name of the place. Probably. You are joking! I have to beat up a cat? That is not common. Is it mashing me up? It kind of is. Oh well. Forgive me my sins! Oh god, it's outside of my range. I have to kick it. Hmm. Well, that's just not right. Some kind of shot after that. Ooh. Okay. Thought that was two people. But instead it's a... A license? Ugh. Issued 98. Date of birth. 19... <laughs> She's over 50 years old. Hmm. Grotty. 
I would be pilfering so much from this place. Oh, and she does as well. She just takes a note, though. You can do better than that. Sheriff, telephone, address. All right. Is that useful in any way? Oh, this is useful. A save point. Alright, here is Hector's garage. Oh no, Hector! Oh god, he's fast, isn't he? Alright, that's... that's not cutting it. Am I even hitting him there? This is just not right. Right, I think I get... no, I'm not sure I get it. Am I even hurting the guy here? He's certainly hurting me. I thought maybe I have to crush him under this. I think he deserved better. Obtain scissor jack and cigar ball. What was I even meant to be coming here for? I don't know, but using up all of my first aid kits, evidently. Yeah, Pyramid Head was absolutely unkillable. The only thing that killed Pyramid Head was himself. But didn't he kind of whore himself out afterwards? Same with the sexy nurses. I mean, there was a reason we had Pyramid Head and sexy nurses in Silent Hill 2. What reason would they have to be in the other ones? Again, wouldn't know. Silent Hill 2 is the only Silent Hill I'd played, but I had heard that uh, they'd be making appearances in the other game. No, that's not true. I played the arcade games. Oh, well, the arcade game, and it sucked. Real bad. Mulder. Mulder, it's me. Find anything? Caitlin Winslow's diary. You were right, Scully. These girls had nothing to do with real witchcraft, but they were used for some larger purpose to divert people from some sinister truth, something we're not seeing yet. We have to find her, Scully. Well, there's no sign of Caitlin Winslow here, but I found a spare key to wherever she works. Now, there are long rants in this diary about her asshole bosses at the shop, Easy. I'm looking at the map. That's in the northeast corner of town. From what I've seen, I don't know if we'll be able to find an open road through to there. Meet me at the fire station, Mulder. I think I have a way through. Wasn't the fire station on fire? I feel like I haven't investigated this place very much. Maybe there's some more aspirin to steal. No, not from you. Kudos to them getting the uh, the actual actors to do the voice acting in this game. So. A dollar sixty-five for some regular unleaded. What a time. 
And that's a gallon, not even a litre. You'd be that for a litre of petrol back home. Yes, bow to me in my fantastic light here. Oh god, that sudden snap of the angle is getting me. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's the bank. Not what I'm looking for, sadly. Okay, no, that's not the fire station, it's just a fire engine, one of. So where is the fire station? Ski Lodge, Bank, Sheriff Station... Not seeing any indication where the fire station is, though. Oh yeah, I can imagine a lot of people haven't been doing a lot of driving lately. I sold my car uh, years ago, though. Kind of looking forward to the day that I want to get a car again. Are you a gas station? No, you're not. You're not gas station. Fire station. Those two shouldn't mix. It was on the map, wasn't it? If it was, it completely passed me by there. FDRF. Fire Department something something maybe there was a giant uh, gate there which would uh, reasonably have been for a fire engine better take a look my footsteps are again all bloody I'm guessing that's just something that happens temporarily after running through a dead corpse oh Ammo and... Okay, I thought maybe I could... Yeah, I can save off of that. That's amazing. Do they do that in the show? Pick up some duct tape, just make an X on something, and then look at it to record their thoughts. Definitely not, says Hoovy Whoopens. But Kaiser says, no, they did that all the time. And I'll believe Kaiser, because it's exactly what I wanted to hear. A lot of disbelief to suspend for this game, but I'll keep it suspended. I'd be tempted to go and watch the show after this, to be honest, but I have a feeling it would be a pretty dated experience. Alright. Okay, well, this is a bit of a giveaway that it's the fire department. You with the auto club? I've been waiting. I trust you're man enough to work that thing. Man enough? Oh, why do you hurt me, Scully? <laughs> Ladies first. <laughs> That's all he's going to do. <laughs> oh, man, I like this Mulder character. <laughs> Mulder? What an what asshole! You work this thing? Now what? You keep going, Scully. I'll find another way around. <laughs> oh, man after my own heart here, this Mulder. That's a great response to being challenged if you're man enough to do something, though.
Whoa, now. What, you're down already? Damn, I was hoping for some uh, stylistic looking off screen beating for you. Oh, right, there's something we haven't put to the test just yet. Sure, we'll do that one-handed. What's with all the moldy old boxes in a fire department? I've visited quite a few fire departments. Nice places. There was always a lot of whiskey in them. there. Oh, what a bloody mess. Yeah, there'd be a breakout room like this. Wouldn't have somebody sloshed over the TV, though. Never messy, though. This is good, though. This is atmospheric. Holy mother of mercy, what? Don't burn your pumps there, Dana. Beat the fire out. Interesting way to reload uh, Magnum there. Steal their first aid. You dare! Ah! Oh. Don't want to hurt the dog. Oh damn! They take a they take a few shots and a half. I take a few nibbles and a half. Firemen, the firewomen, even the fire dogs. None shall be spared. Any more for any more? Oh, jeez! <laughs> Was a little comical. Oh, I must be running out of ammo on this thing. a bit more gory before, you know, with that guy getting their uh, arm ripped off and that receptionist having both of their arms amputated off. Now it's just 
Silent Hill-esque zombies going on. Should I grab a shopping cart? Can you make a joke in every situation, Mulder? Maybe someone is making a joke of our situation. Look what I found. The stiletto used to kill alien life with a stab to the back of the neck. Mulder, what does it mean? I don't know. I don't know, but better have your gun out. That's cool. That's well cool. Alright, what else is in store for this dynamic duo? Okay, what's the implication of the, the dogs and cats going ham? Did they get infected? Did someone go and bite them? I'd rather think if you bit a cat, at least it's going to bleed out before it uh, gets infected enough to do anything. But I'm sure there'll be an explanation. Is that going to help me heal up? That's a yes. Seemed to heal up more than a full first aid kit and it was just a bandage. Oh, that stuff's going to spoil if the energy's not going. Another empty beer bottle. Wish we could pick up one of these uh, bats though. Something to augment our close combat uh, abilities. Then again, our fists are probably plenty good enough. We don't have Dead Rising Steven bursting out with a modified shopping cart to maul us down. He was a tough bugger to kill. I was expecting to find some kind of key that'll help me get around the back there, but it's not happening. Every other episode ends with Scully monologuing. We may never know what was actually assaulting us in that abandoned coal mine. It had six wings and four mouths, but I know there's a natural explanation. Somewhat tempted to... Can you even like, watch this anywhere? Surely, but... I don't, I don't know how the process goes. If you think of a TV show that you want to watch, how do you go about watching it? How do normal people go about watching it if it came out 20 plus years ago? Okay, I'm sh certain I missed something in here. Blinding light was distracting me from what I need to grab. Or maybe this was just a happy reunion with Mulder. Okay, well, if it's here, I sure can't find it. Download it through internet. Oh, I thought that said uh, extraterrestrial means, which would have been more fitting. Oh, can we get through here? We need to find kit. Now, can we just leave? This is clearly a threat to our lives here. All right, Mulder, are you man enough to go through that fire? Aquarium fun for us. 
No rainbow. Is that a rainbow? No, it's a rainbow art supplies. Thought it was another antiques place. No Mulder, this dog was dead when I found it. And then there's here, is that it? Well, hopefully he'll have the balls to plant one into the dog if it comes running and nibbling at us. Was there somewhere that I didn't check out back there? No, I think it was just the pinup. Oh, that doesn't sound good. You take care of it. Why do I keep thinking that up is the button for that? Alright. For legal reasons, it was my partner that killed you. Although I will steal your magnum rounds. Hold on, magnum ant? Did I get another magnum? Guess not, but hey. I guess if you hadn't already found a magnum, that would be your source of one. God, what a mess. Was there so much death in the X-Files? The show? I mean, this is a whole small town massacre. I don't know if it got this gory, says Hoovy. Probably just playing it up here then. Usually it's the monster of the week that causes the mass death. Hmm. But we may never truly know what it is that caused all this. Oh, I can't even backtrack here now, can I? Because this thing got shut off by uh, Mulder failing in his manly duties. Okay, I'm a little lost on where to go then. Unless I missed that key for the uh, for the wee shop, which seems plausible, but I did check it over multiple to out of my way, out of my way. There we go. Draw the gun. Let him know he's in charge. I do think tank controls are vastly superior to whatever this is. But then, who was it who was recently playing a game with tank controls and messing it up so hard you'd think they had brain problems? I feel like it was JJ, because when I say the word brain problems, he just immediately comes to mind. But then again, I've played a lot of tank control games, so they're very familiar to me. but certain missed something in the super easy supermarket. I'll check the outside first though, just in case. If I recall well, Silent Hill has a moment where you just need to wander off into an inconspicuous area of uh, greenery to pick up an important item that you need to proceed. But it's been years since I've played through Silent Hill. It was the 100th Two Hours of Hell, marking the end of the Two Hours of Hell formula. So it's not exactly fresh in mind.
There have been two living characters that we've found in this game so far. One of them we killed by shooting him, the other one we've left for dead. We left him inside a prison cell. Alright, activate eyes. There must be something I'm missing here. Specifically keys for the back of that, uh, back of this place. Jake, I've never played a Silent Hill game. Is it randomizable? I don't know. I've only played it vanilla. Yeah, I've been mashing X on the checkouts as well. Oh well, at least uh, at least till one is open. This place is an absolute mess. I'm not seeing diddly here. If it weren't for the buzzing of the faulty fluorescent lighting though, this would be a pretty cozy area. I'm all but lost. What do I need to do here? This feels like a song that we're playing after the uh, the death of somebody important to the characters. As it stands, the only thing that's died is this supermarket. Not really much of a supermarket, though, is it? Is that a VHS collection? Okay, is it something that I've already picked up and don't know it? Like this cigar box? Uh... So, to Dark Young who said, I see it, Jake, come on, you can't be that blind, I'm thinking five days. There we go. That was very much like Resident Evil 1. She's hypothermic and in shock. We have to get her out of here. <laughs> okay. We'll do just that then. I've been inside one of those, it's not that cold. You'd have to be in there a long time for it to start threatening you. Caitlin, can you talk to us? Tell us what happened. I don't want to die. We're here to help you. The doctors wanted to help us. Why? Why did they do those things to us? Scully, take her out the back. Mulder, what about- Damn it, Scully, just do it. Yeah, he seems to know what he's doing. Not like that pump jack incident. Coming to get you, Caitlin. I was gonna say you can run, but you can't hide. But damn, can she run, and damn, can she hide. Where'd she go? She ran into here, she sure did it fast.
Doctor's doing things, they hurt them, signs of hypothermia, why was she in a freezer? Body temperature must be increased before I press for details. Well, how fortuitous. The serendipitous duck brings its own leak. Where even am I? This doesn't feel like uh, the same area. Not even showing up here anymore. More to the point, how did she pass by here unscathed? I feel that scathing is about to come to me. Oh lord! The city of the damned is rising up on me here. Often in these games, do they have no wait? Maybe it's just a midget. It does seem angry enough. Normally, in zombie games, they completely uh, ignore the existence of children. But you know which zombie film didn't? Dawn of the Dead. Hell, that game started off by the big cheese uh, gunning down a couple of kids. There wasn't even any indication that they were zombie kids. Okay, what am I even doing here? Nothing seems to want to open or interact with me in any meaningful way. Aside from wanting to chew on my ankles. Uh, well, yeah, the ankles are thoroughly chewed, but just the ankles. Oh, does Cyberpunk 77 have unkillable children? Such nonsense. Okay, if there's somewhere that I can go and do anything, it's eluding me hard. Yeah, the kid fights better than the adults here. set ourselves on fire. Zombies can't touch you if you're on fire. Oh wait, I, I wonder if these guys are holding something and I need to kill them to pick it off their dead bodies. Or their re-dead bodies. Mm, couldn't lure him into the fire. Or rather, it didn't do anything. Way to raise Caitlin's temperature. What the hell is going on here? Got no indication of fit to dee or far to gee. Pretty sure I tried going down there though. I quite like the washed out color palette though, reminds me of Eco. Alright, you know, there's one thing that I do want to do, and that's just die. We haven't seen what happens when Dana here gets munched on to death. Oh god, they're just killing each other. Kill me, you idiots! Because we've gone well over the two hour mark. And 
it's high time we put an end to this punishment game. There was no punishment to be had here. This game's pretty good, especially for the time. Well, good for me. I mean, if you don't like these kinds of oldy schooly Resident Evil, Silent Hilly, uh, Dino Crisisy games, then it's not going to be for you. Are we infected? Would this help? Well, I can't use it, so I guess not. Come on, try harder, kiddo. You're really durable in this game, holy moly. I guess I didn't expect X-File fans, who would be the ones to get the game, to be any good at games, so they make you pretty indestructible. Oh, that was bright. You know, that went on for quite a while, and that was just one episode of one act with one of the playable characters. Looks like a lot went into this game. I'm really impressed with it. So, unfortunately, Tandy and Spengler have failed miserably in giving a good punishment game. But they have brought us a good game game. In any case, I'll be taking the stream down. I'll be back in the evening with some more Caesar 3. We've got to fuel Caesar's alcoholism on what looks to be an incredibly difficult map. So until then, in about 80 or so minutes, it's a cheers and a cheerio.